Hey everyone, it's Tim with Tech Desk Tidbits, and we're here today to talk about FTDI drivers. We're going to download, install, and then we're going to verify that they're working right on your Macintosh computer. So come along and let's check this thing out. Alright, so to start we're going to go to the About This Mac. This will give us our information about the operating system that we're using. Then we'll Google FTDI drivers. We want the VCP, that's Virtual COM Ports. Specifically, we need that. So now I'm using a 10.9.5, so we're going to go over here and we're going to select the option for that. Now the download can take a while. I've gone ahead and sped it up for this video. We'll go ahead and open up the DMG, and then that's going to allow us to open this package. From the package, we've got the install. And this actually, we'll just go ahead and click through, continue on all of these, and agree. And you're going to need administrative access to actually do this step. So go ahead and put in your admin password and install software. And that's a successful install. So now to double check that everything's working correctly, we're going to go ahead and open up Arduino if you're using it. And we've got our FTDI device plugged in. And you can go up to Tools and double check, and there it is listed there. Also notice the A700. That's the serial number of this device. So I'm going to go ahead and type that down here so we can remember that. And then this is the other way to check this. We go to About the Mac, and we do More Information, Run a System Report. Every time we change the, the state of this, it's going to need a new system report run but you'll see the FT232 there listed and that's the matching serial. Also we can notice that there's uh, some information about the power consumption of the device. This is interesting if you're using a specific board that maybe has more regular current required. Alright guys, well I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope that gets your FTDI drivers up and running on your Macintosh. If you like this video, go ahead and like, subscribe, and comment below and uh, follow us along on our website, techdesktidbits.com. See you guys there.